Hey guys, happy new year. Okay, so today I'm doing a look that's going to go from a day look to a night look. So I first started by applying primer from MAC. Um, it's called Sublime Nature all over my lid. And then with um, a pencil from L'Oreal. It's by Hip. It's a chrome pencil um, it's in silver. And I'm applying that in the inner lid only. And I'm blending that slightly. And then I'm going to apply um, Fashion Eyeshadow from MAC. I think this is a limited edition color, so I'm not sure if you can still find this, but it's like a silver blue color. It's um, like a, yeah, so you can use Electra. Electra is a little bit more silver, but it'll still work. And I'm using a 239 brush to apply this all over the lid. And then Cool Heat, it's a, it's a turquoise color. It's a dark turquoise color, actually, and I'm applying that with a 217 brush. And I'm applying it in, in the crease only. And I'm gonna blend it out, but not too much. Like it's not gonna go too high. It's gonna stay pretty much in the crease. Just a little, not too much. And then with black track, I'm gonna use a 219 brush to apply that in the outer corner, like a V-shape in the outer corner. With um, I'm using a 219 because I want to blend that nicely into the crease, just slightly and then down under um, to the lower lash line and this is going to help help uh, keep the black eyeshadow on I'm going to put a black eyeshadow on top of that so for makeup forever I'm going to get the number and put on the sidebar for you guys for this um, eyeshadow it's black with a little shimmer in it and I'm using a 217 to apply that on top of the black track fluid line And then with uh, Urban Decay 24-7, um, I think it's called Electric. It's a pencil. It's a waterproof pencil, actually. And I'm putting that in the inner waterline, in the lower waterline, sorry. And then I'm pulling that out just a little bit. And then with Vanilla, I'm just going to highlight my brow bone. With a 252 brush. And then with Texture... I'm going to use uh, the 222 from MAC to blend out the turquoise color. So it's going to go above the crease slightly to blend and just to get the whole look just to look a little more softer. Um, and then with the 210 brush and black track from MAC, I'm going to line my eyes, the upper lash line actually. And we're going to keep this line pretty... It's not really that thin, but it's it's pretty thin compared to um, I usually thick a thicker line. But I'm using the 210, and this helps you create a nice thin line. It's a very thin brush. A lot of people like to use a 209. It's a little bit thicker, or many people use an angle brush to apply liner, which is um, it's just a different techniques, um, different brushes. Um, and I'm also applying it on the lower lash line. They're very thin this time, and then I'm just gonna apply it under there and then also I'm just gonna um, do a little cat eye but not too extreme just very simple very small and then just blending on that adding any more color there I'm just blending with the 222 and then with lash glass of course I'm just gonna apply that behind the lashes and apply it on the lashes and this is the final look I hope you guys like it. And then, to intensify this look, we're just going to add a couple of more steps to it. So I went out, and then I'm back for the evening, and now we're just going to add some glitz and glamour to get a nice night look. So I first start by applying that same hip silver liner, I, but I'm just going to apply this all over the lid. And this liner is pretty cool because it doesn't crease, it's really nice. And then I'm just going to intensify that turquoise by using Clarity. Um, it's a nice shadow by MAC, it's a um, matte color and it's, uh, it's very bright. 
so I'm just gonna apply that and remember in the beginning we kept it just in the crease this time we're gonna pull it out and pull it up a little higher so it's gonna be a little bit more dramatic so you can actually see the turquoise from a distance and I'm using the 217 to apply that and then I'm gonna blend that with the 222 brush and then with some glitter from MAC, the Reflex Transparent Teal. I'm just going to apply that on the lid. And this is going to stick um, because the liner that I put in the beginning, it's a little, you know, it, it's still a little sticky. It hasn't really dried out. So it's going to hold on to that glitter. Um, if you want, you can use like a, um, a liner sealer. Makeup Forever makes one. Many companies have some sealers that will hold your glitter. And I'm just going to intensify that black with the black eyeshadow by Makeup Forever because we want to intensify all the colors and we want all the colors to pop out a little bit more than they did for the day look. So we're intensifying everything. And I don't want the, the glitter to go up to the brow bone so I'm just going to make sure that that's nice and clean. And then this is a glitter liner from MAC. It was a limited edition. It came out with the Hello Kitty collection. It's really cool. It's nice to use like underneath because it, you don't have a lot of fallout. So I'm just going to draw a little line on the, um, on the lower lash line. And then I'm also going to use the liquid last um, turquoise eyeliner. And I'm applying that on the outer part of the eye on the lower lash line. Um, I don't have rec I didn't record this, but I do end up in the end after you're gonna see you'll notice in the pictures that I have a little bit more eyeliner I do add more eyeliner on the bottom and the top so if you notice it's a little darker I did add some eyeliner um, you could do that if you'd like if you want it more intense and I just added a little glitter with that same gel liner and I put that on my lashes this is the final look I hope you guys enjoyed I hope you like it please subscribe rate and comment lots of love guys thank you